everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a Primark haul for you. Now, the last time I did this was in March, I think. So, yeah, a little more overdue. <laughs> so, I thought I would go into Primark and pick some nice stuff up that I've wanted for a bit um, because I've seen a few things on YouTube and people doing Primark hauls and just... So I went into Primark and I literally couldn't find half the stuff in Primark that I actually wanted so it was a bit of a fail but I did get a few more, I did get a few things that I wanted and some extra bits as well and I just literally had a gander around in Primark for ages and uh, yeah so I'm going to show you what I got and yeah so let's get into the video. So the first thing that I'm pulling out of my bag is this kind of like board thing. I was going to try and bend it like this. Um, it's just a wired frame and inside it's just got like postcard kind of style things in it. Um, and this was only £6. I wanted this to kind of put photos and stuff in rather than actual like things like this because like no. Um, so I bought this to put photos in and things because I've seen this on YouTube and I thought I want one of these to put on the wall. So I'm going to peg like little photos on it and things like that, try and make it as a memory board and yeah, so there's that. Then I wanted some sunglasses, now I wanted these particular style sunglasses but when I tried these particular style sunglasses on, they didn't suit me at all. So I was a bit gutted about that, um, so I picked one other design instead which actually these suit me better. Um, and it was the kind of the cat eye kind of look and I really liked them, I really really liked them but I was so... <laughs> I'll say this bit that they didn't actually like suit my face or anything so yeah so I picked up these aviator looking ones and they're kind of like a purple green blue and yellow um, shade and then they have like 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 a spotty what's it called like a I don't know what it's called like a spotty kind of design on the side if you can see that it's just like thing all the way across and I actually really like these these suit me a little bit more better and um, these are only three quid and it comes like with a little pouch as well so it's really nice so I'm just gonna try them on and just show you see I'm um, cool dang thing um, Oh my god, they don't actually see me do they? Oh my god. So yeah, these are the ones that I picked and I really really like them. Um, they're really nice and everything. My brother said they suit me better than the cat eye ones. So uh, yeah, I bought those and they were only three quid. Then I picked up some new kind of trainer styled shoe things and there was a certain pair in this that I wanted. I wanted the black and then they had like a rose gold, well, a couple kind of trimming. But again, they didn't have my size, which they never do. Every time I go in, I think, oh, they're nice shoes. They don't have my size. Because I have big feet, so that's probably why. And they only had size five, and I'm size eight or seven. So I picked this colour up instead, and it's just a white, and then it's just got a silver um, toe and the back as well. And it's just kind of like a big platform um, plimsoll kind of design I really really like these these are actually in size 7 because they're quite wide um, so yeah they did have the black version in it and then they had like a copper kind of rose gold um, glittery toe which I really wanted but again they didn't have my size so I picked up these and these are only £10 now I know these are really comfortable anyway because I've had this kind of style of shoe from Primark before so yeah, I picked up some of those. Then I picked up three t-shirts, which are just plain, and these are two pound each. So I just got a pale kind of blue color. I did pick these up before um, when I went to Primark. I'm sure they were 2 50 each, but I don't know. But anyway, these are two pound each. They're just kind of a normal kind of plain t-shirt. I like these to put underneath other clothing that are a bit more see-through or a bit more revealing, shall I say. Um, so I got a light blue one and I got a pale pink one this time which I do have like a darker more mauvey kind of coloured one but I put up the pink one instead and then I do have a dark blue and a light blue now so yeah and these are only £2 each which these are really good and these are really nice as well they feel like really soft 
that's like a thing with t-shirts in Primark, I don't know. Um, these are really nice and yeah, they're only £2 each. Then I literally cannot go in Primark without picking some of these cotton pads up. So these are just the oval cosmetic pads and these are 90p. You can't go into Primark without picking any of these up because like, how can you not? So yeah, I picked up some of them. Then I picked up two little bags of elastics. Now I've been looking for these because I've run out of my white ones. Um, and I've been looking for these for a while and then I saw them in Primark and I like the little pouch they came, they come in, they come in. I like the little pouch that they come in um, so they're like neat and tidy and these are only a pound each. You get 300 of them in these and you get black, white and brown um, and obviously you pick up whatever you want but I thought I'd pick up brown so it like blends in my hair a little bit better. If I do like French plaits or plaits in general they blend in rather than white where it's a bit more obvious and um, so I picked up two packs of them because I need them and yeah and then I picked up this tote bag because originally my idea was to put some of the stuff that I bought from Primark into this bag but I didn't <laughs> so it was kind of a waste of time but I think I might get mum to make it into a pillow she said she would so I might get to make it into a pillow instead and um, it's just a kind of beigey tote bag and it's just got Minnie and Mickey Mouse on it and I just really liked it but again, obviously originally I was going to put stuff in it, but I didn't, um, and this was £3, and yeah, this would be really nice as a pillow, so I might make, I might ask someone to make it into a pillow for me. And then I did pick up a new work bag, which I'll insert a picture for you because I'm currently using it, and I just can't be asked to go back downstairs to get it. It's just a pale kind of denim blue looking backpack, and it's just got embroidered butterflies on it, and I just think it's really, really nice. And it's just got like plain black straps um, and then it's got like a zip at the front and it's just got one zip at the top which is obviously the main compartment and it's got like little pockets inside as well which is really really nice it's kind of similar design to my other bag that I had but my other bag is ripping so that's why I got another, another one and this one attracted me because it had butterflies on it because I really like butterflies and um, so yeah I don't know how it'd be in like the rain and stuff don't think it'd be very practical because it's not a kind of waterproof bag but yeah it was only nine pound and i really really like it so yeah that's it i thought i picked up a little bit more from primark i did pick up some pajamas but they were from my mom so they're not actually mine um but yeah that's it that's it so i hope you enjoyed that little primark call i know it wasn't massive i don't think i ever do a massive primark call ever um because I just I don't know I don't know I just don't um but yeah hope you enjoyed that little Primark haul if you did please give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe just here and I will see you in my next video bye